What is to be sung transpired in days of yore, when the Divine Archon still walked the Earth? A dragon cast his curious gaze on the world below, as he parted from the heavens that gave his birth. The dragon sought truth amongst common folk, but mortal trifles only fogged his mind. The wind-born bard strummed his strings dolce, and the holy lyre answered his questions kind. The dragon was but a child full of wonder, and soared the heavens free from care. The bard's songs invited him to sing along, for he yearned to let all perceive him fair. Enchanting legends the bard and dragon were, but the tides of despair soon engulfed the land. The lion fang perished, and the falcon flag slept, as a vile dragon approached Mondstadt in the lone stand. Over the cathedral loomed death and his friends. Of the people's agony, the bard soon sang. The soaring dragon heeded his grave calls, and amidst the windstorms a brutal war sprang. Blood of Venom sent the Sky Dragon into slumber. Only to awake to be expelled in abhor. Why do people in this age loathe me so? But the Holy Liar replied no more. Wrath and woe, vigor and venom, poured from the dragon's bitter eyes. The dragon's curse sprawled in silence, but the liar could no longer soothe his cries. Wait, you guys are... Oh, that's right. You're the ones that scared Dvalin away. Devalin? Who's that? Huh? Oh, right! Most people seem to call him Storm Terror. Why do you call him that? Are you two meant to be close or something? Oh, so close. Hey, so... Paimon thinks this guy has a screw loose. Venti the Bard. Three-time winner of the most popular bard of Mondstadt, to be precise. So, given you recognize us, Paimon does it. Of course it's a- Store? Hey, cut it with the amnesia act! All right, show it to him. Oh, what? The crystal has been purified? When? Tavalin, he- the anguish he feels has brought him to tears. Tears? He was once such a gentle child, now so full of rage and suffering. I also came across a teardrop crystal. Can you purify it? do have some wonderful abilities. Someone like you is going to end up getting written into a bard's poem. Oh, a hero so bright should she stand in the light, though stand in the shade, and you'll be met by a blade. Alas, I've really not the time to come. Anyway, he'll burn himself out in the flames of anger. Thank you for that, and for purifying the teardrop crystal. But I have my own- Oh? And what- Seeing this tear has brought- Friend? <laughs> One- Hey, where are you- To the symbol of Mondstadt's hero! Bye bye Huh. What do you make of that? As far as he's concerned, you're a weirdo too- No what? Familiar? I don't know. You're alone on that one.
But did he just say symbol of Mondstadt's hero? Oh, Paimon knows it's that huge tree. You know, the gigantic one. You can't miss it. Surely you still remember. here though I was just wondering if you would happen to follow me You speak of the god of Animo, Barbados? He already disappeared from Mondstadt a long time ago. Liyue and Inazuma's respective gods of Geo and Electro are still present, but Mondstadt has seen many a moon since they last saw their own god. Why do you wish to know about the god of Animo? Does it have something to do with Devalin? Oh, uh, it's because gods... Um... Just how is it that everyone sees Storm Terror? I'm quite curious. That said, there's no need to rush. I have not been back in a while. It seems there are a few who are unhappy with my arrival. The wind! I can't open my eyes! What is a creature like that doing out here in such a calm place? Do you think it was going after that green guy? His relationship with the wind seems even deeper than yours.
you're in for a little shock. For a little shock, come a little closer. <laughs> You're in for a little shock. Closer. He You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. <laughs> Come a little. Seems the dragon wasn't the only thing affected by this change in the wind. Now then. So, quite the scholar, I must say that, Lisa. She's not wrong. The conflict has reached this point only because both sides have resorted to the use of force. His hate, however, did not arise from the people not making tribute to the Four Winds. Nor was it born from his own nature, but instead came about as a product of his degradation. Degradation? The black blood flowing through his heart has been... That's what has allowed him to be led astray by the lies of the Abyss Mage. They are from the Abyss Order, an organiz... I don't know, many hilly trolls out in the wild t before... But now, the wind amongst the branches is good. Being here with... So, how it- Uh, that would be because I tried to communicate with Devalin earlier, but was... interrupted. As a result, not only did I not manage to help Devalin break his curse, but instead was also infected myself.
Yes, it was you. So to make up for it, you're coming with the Monsac Cathedral to claim a certain holy liar de... Anything the knights can do for you. Fortunate. De Hamel is... One of the most treasured items in Mondstadt. It's the lyre that Barbados used to play. With it, perhaps I can help Duvalin draw his gentle nature back out of this nightmare he's going through. Will it really stop Storm Terror from causing more damage? Of course! I'm the best bard in the world. There's not a single song I do not know, no matter if it's from the past, present, or future. Look me in the eyes. Do you not find me trustworthy?
So how can we get the Holy Liar? It's said that it's enshrined deep within the cathedral, somewhere safe. I'll go take a look around. You can come if you want. Interesting. Report it to the church. Let me handle this. There, sister. May the Animo God bless you, young bard. How can I help you? Actually, I know a secret that can save Mondstadt from its current predicament. Oh, what a blessing from the God of Animo! But you should report that to the Knights of Favonius. Why have you come to me? <laughs> I'd like to bar. Please see. What? It's a vicious dragon. That's simply not acceptable. Wouldn't Storm Terror end up getting killed that way? That foolish beast betrayed the winds. Not even the god of Animo themselves would forgive it. Please, I beg of you. I'm afraid not, little bard. Strange. Somehow I feel so bad rejecting this sweet child. Then, I guess I'm left with no other choice. I cannot hide anymore. My disciples, rejoice! Behold, the god of Animo, Barbados, has descended! Shocked, aren't you? Don't you just want to cry out and rejoice? How does it feel to finally meet the god you've been serving? If there's nothing else, I'll be going back to handle the cathedral's paperwork now. Oh, wait! She didn't even bat an eyelid, but I have... She didn't deny that the cathedral isn't... Now, since you're the hotshot of the Knights of Favonius... Maybe you can give it a shot. Barbados bless you. I know you. You and Amber saved Mondstadt that day. So what brings you here? Tasks from the... Is that so? Not that I don't trust you. It's just that a suspicious bard came looking to borrow the Holy Liar as well. He's full of nonsense and even called himself Barbados. He must be up to something. There are regulations in place for the use of the Holy Liar. Currently, it's only used in Ludihar Pastum. Signed documents from the Grand Master, Seneschal, and Community Representative are all required. So, may I see the document from the Knights of Favonius? Hey! A signed document is required. Without it, there's not much I can do. Now, if you'll excuse me, I really am quite busy as of late. Oh, it didn't work. I knew it. <laughs> you knew it? I just wanted to know how influential the hotshot of the Knights of Favonius is. You see, the best warrior should always be presented with the best sword. Just the story not ma- So what are you tr- No, that's not it. 
More of a commentary regard. Very well. Today we stand for free will. Come now, speak up. That's what. <laughs> Look at you, sidetracked from the start. But seriously, aside from singing, I don't really have any other. Besides, if I was. How can it be? The things are. Should you get. The guards here. If we meant. Stop mentioning us. What do you say? Ah, uh, yes. Seems I did meant. Your point being. Why does your decision hinge upon whether or not I am a god? Paimon will fill you in on her background story when we get the time. Huh?
What are you doing oh, here? No! Master D. Luke, this is this week's accounts. <sighs> the disaster has greatly affected business. Well, let's hope it all ends soon. Hi! We'd like a seat at your, uh, least conspicuous table. Um, the second floor has fewer customers. You'd be less conspicuous up there. But aren't you a bard? Why not sit front and center? Save the paid performance for next time. We'll be heading up now. See you in a bit. Hey, keep an eye on them. There's something strange about that bard. I'll go ask around. Ask who exactly? The protectors of Mondstadt. Not going upstairs yet? You both seemed to be in a hurry. Master Diluc, have you seen two thieves around? <sighs> Why?
What happened? Why have you mobilized so many guards? <laughs> Haven't you heard, Master D. Luke? Two thieves are trying to steal the Holy Liar! Huh? How odd. Isn't it? The Holy Liar is a treasure that was played by the god of animal themselves! Such a precious piece of cultural heritage! Why would one want to steal something they can't sell off? Would pay better to steal from my sellers. Huh? Sorry, off topic. Believe they headed that way. Understood. Thank you, Master Diluc. Today, I think I'll have a... You can put down that bottle you stole from behind the counter. Something cold. Right. I want answers. Let me finish my drink first. I'll pay you. Well, with a performance. It's not about money. You seem too young to be drinking. No need to worry. When I started drinking, you were still... He is Master Diluc, the boss of... the... Uh, the owner of this tavern. He's very famous. By the way, his dandelion wine is one of my favorites. Although most of the time I can only afford a bottle or two. I just heard about some thieves from the guards. For the record, I like your guts for trying to steal the Holy Lyo de Hamel. Even if you are fools. But we don't often get to see people like you. Stole it. The real thief is still out there. This is the hotshot of the Knights of Favonius. Why would someone so aspiring steal Mondstadt's sacred treasure? Hotshot? Oh, so it's you. So, you and the Bard are close friends? Despite only being a passing traveler, you still offered your help to Mondstadt in its time of need. A shame you joined the Knights. The Knights of Favonius. Inefficient right from beginning to end. And towards the Fatui? Weak and conservative. Forget it. I don't feel like talking about it. Seems you don't really like the Knights of Favonius. Just differences in approach is all. I have my own hopes for this city. Now, answers. You sure? That's fine. I somehow always end up- If I tell you the- It depends. Then will I get- Your reward- Very well. What did I just witness? This is confidential inf- Why? Hmm, perhaps the winds are changing. What say you, Master D. Luke? Interesting. Give me some time. I'll organize some contacts. Outlander, as one of the knights, it seems- Blonde as the- as <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Let's meet here tonight after the tavern closes. Remember.
Abyssosk.
I will protect you. I want to help. I guess I'll post an expedition at the Adventurer's Guild. happen again. Something terrible happen again.
gotta try Don Winery's Dan. You're here. Wait, you're... Well, first of all, I contacted more than one person. Secondly, she came here as Jean herself, not as the acting Grandmaster. A Jean you would never see, even as an honorary knight. What a surprise. I heard about the Holy Liar, but I never suspected it was you. So, the sound of the Holy Liar can purify Storm Terror and return it to normal? Is that true? That's right! Your honorary knight is putting themselves on the front line to try and resolve this Storm Terror issue. Now that's the hot shot of the Knights of Favonius I'm talking about. Feels like we're breaking the law, though. I understand this kind of absurd explanation is hard to believe. But we can ask the Bard to play the song again to try and persuade... I believe you. To persuade our stubborn command... Wait, what? I can't think of any reason for Devalin's betrayal, given it was once one of the Four Winds. However, if it was poisoned in the battle over Mondstadt all those years ago, and then corrupted by the Abyss Mage after it woke up, we can't really blame it. But as Acting Grandmaster, I obviously cannot make such a statement publicly. Diplomatic pressure from the Fatui makes it hard for us to seek a peaceful resolution to the Storm Terror issue. People would think I've lost grip on the gravity of the situation. That's why I can only do this in private. <laughs> That's one of the reasons I don't like the Knights of Favonius. What surprises me is that you would believe in Outlander so easily. My cautious and meticulous superior, even you trust him, don't you, sir? <sighs> I already told you not to call me sir. Never mind. We don't often get to work together, after all. Uh... <clears throat> wow, um... This is really awkward. I have a rough idea of where the Holy Liar de Hamel is. Nice recovery. She's really talented at changing the subject. The conflict between Mondstadt and Shneznaya stems from the conflict between the Seven Nations and their respective gods. The Cryo Gods Fatui seem to be after the Animo Gods' power. Uh... Right. If the Knights of Favonius publicly prevented an attempt on Duvalin's head, then the only other way to affect the Animo God's power is to take the Holy Liar. The number of Fatui that have come to Mondstadt is far from limited. I've already managed to coerce a few reports out of them. Diluc has determined that the Holy Liar is not being held in the Goth Grand Hotel. 
I imagine they don't want to leave something stolen in a place where it could be so easily found. Paimon gets it. If too much of a scene gets made, then it becomes a big diplomatic issue. <laughs> Such is the diplomacy between the Seven Nations. 